Education is a systemic good. It's built in by governments, it's delivered at scale, and so it can be very hard to change systems, to get systems to be more efficient, especially since they're political and they're based on, on the capabilities that exist. And so working to reform systems, both from a motivation standpoint, from a capability standpoint, but then bringing in innovation that we're seeing in the private sector, um, in universities and colleges, in the tech sector, um, and making them scalable by these institutions, that's really where the key lies, and getting everyone to talk together and push in the same direction. We certainly see anecdotally that in the countries where we've worked on, on building savings accounts for girls, the girls uniformly tell us the reason they're saving is for their education. The impact of a girl's education is w well documented. So what we're, we're very keen to measure is are the girls who have savings in their own name that are dedicating those for um, educational purposes, are they staying in secondary school longer and are you, are you able to realize that education benefit um, through access to the savings account. Right now we just have such a huge gap in the number of women who are actually creators of technology. More and more women are using technology around the world, but we just really have an enormous gap in terms of the number of girls and women going into computer science, into engineering, and we absolutely need to change that. We need to change the, the stereotypes. Um, we need girls and women to be able to see themselves in these careers, have near peers and, and, um, mo and role models that they can connect with and understand um, what this career path can look like. And the second piece is really connecting it to making an impact. One thing we've heard from uh, girls and young women we've engaged with is that a lot of the engineering disciplines and computer science, they don't see how a, a career for them in those fields connects to the ability to have a, so, a positive social impact. And we know the power of engineering, and we know the power of technology to change people's lives. We need to do a better job at transforming that. We're seeing the first wave of young girls in India and Malawi who have participated in some way and joined My Village or benefited from those programs now go on to university. So in many instances, these young women um, are absolute pioneers. Um, often the, you know, the first in their region certainly um, to attend university and so when we start to realize how quickly we can positively impact individuals, families, communities in that way, it makes us realize just the, um, how quickly that cycle of change can take place and so um, by focusing on women and girls we're actually able to have the greatest impact um, on the entire community.